Hey everybody, I got my, I'm retooling my decoys and these are the Avian X decoys I've had for about the last oh, seven or eight years. I'm giving them to a good friend of mine that's hunting with me uh, most of my life. And uh, I swapped over to dive bombs. So I just kind of want to go over the difference between what I had and now what I have. This is an Avian X and there ain't nothing wrong with Avian X decoys. And uh, I bought them because I like the way they look. And uh, there are some differences. And you can kind of see the size difference. That's the dive bomb right here. That's the Avian X. Dive bomb's a little bit bigger. And uh, the Avian X have a softer plastic on them. And the dive bombs look a lot more rigid. And uh, here's another one. This is, uh, that's an Avian X. You know, has a little bit softer plastic. There's a keel set up, and I always drill a hole in the bottom of my decoys right there to run my line through because I don't run it through that or this little hole that gets in the decoy. And then this is the dive bomb. And uh, the difference between this decoy and this one, this one's been used for five years. Just got this one out of the box. And uh, this is the decoy that uh, I saw online and uh, it was in a it was in a uh a instagram advertisement and when i saw it i said i want to swap for those so that's kind of a comparison that's the size a little bit size difference they're not great big giant decoys but they're just a little bit bigger and that's what i like and uh just keep in mind that those avian x have been used for a while both of them great decoys. I just chose Dive Bomb because of the size and because they are, they've got harder plastic on them. So anyways, that's what I'm doing on my Saturday afternoon.